Hi friends, today I am going to start with series of video based upon theorems related to circles in which we will be discussing various kind of theorems along with their proofs. And today we are going to start with the first theorem which states that angles subtended by equal chords of a circle at the center are equal. If we have a circle with center O and there are two chords AB and CD such that both the chords are equal in length. In that case, the angle subtended by both the chords at the center that is angle AOB and angle COD will be equal in length means equal chords subtend equal angles at the center and this is the statement of the theorem also. Now next question is how are we going to prove this theorem we will be taking these two triangles and we will prove that triangle AOB is congruent to triangle COD and if these two triangles are congruent then the corresponding parts of these triangles have to be equal. So we can always say that the angles are equal and let us start with the proof step by step. Step number one is we will be writing whatever is given to us and we are given a circle with center O in which the uh, chords AB and CD are given and both the chords have same length. So these two chords are equal it is given. Now what we are going to prove is the angle subtended by the chords at the center that is angle AOB is equal to angle COD. Now proof we will be starting with the triangles triangle AOB I will be taking this triangle triangle AOB and triangle COD and step by step we will prove that these triangles are congruent. Yeah. First of all AB and CD these two chords are equal it is already given to us chord AB is equal to CD and next one is the side OB equals to side OD because these are radii of the circle and we know that all the radii of a given circle are equal. And the last one OA equals to OC again radii of the circle. Now we have proved that the three sides of first triangle are equal to the corresponding sides of the second triangle. We can always say that the triangles are congruent and if these triangles are congruent by side 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 congruency rule then the corresponding side of these triangles have to be equal and these angles will be equal and hence the proof of the theorem. So this was all about the first theorem. Next time we will be discussing converse of this theorem. If you like this video click on like button subscribe to watch more videos. So see you next time. Till then thank you and have a nice day.